And today, especially after we did all that traveling and Whoa! Dang it. That's why I don't like playing with nether. I mean, obsidian. Lighting myself on fire. So I'm thinking of doing the extra single player series. The Athens series, which is the name of the server I belong to, collaboration series. I'm thinking of possibly doing a uploading, well, doing a weekly live stream for an hour or so of writing music and uploading that um, once a week. And I'm also thinking of doing a CTM series. Fortune, Silk, I want this guy. But I'm not a, a good CTM player. That I know of. I've um, done diversity on my own and got through it okay. Maybe a little cheaty here and there. Um, I've tried like a Vex map here and there. And, you know, I just kind of rush in instead of preparing for it properly. But uh, watching... Zisto do his Pantheon, which is going on now, has uh, encouraged me to try the same sort of series. I mean, I'm not going to do Pantheon right now, but maybe in the future. And so these are all different series that I have on mind, in mind right now. Season has ended down here in Florida, which means instead of working every single day, I have a few days off each week. But at the same time, the days that I do work tend to be a little bit longer and it's a little more tiring because now the heat is on down here, as Glenn Fry has so wisely written songs about. Um, so that's why I'm thinking I'm going to be able to do these series pretty easy. Because I'm so far ahead with this series that I don't have to worry about um, keeping up with it. As long as I record once a week, this series is fine. And again, the, the thing that takes the most amount of time with this series is not the recording, it's the editing. And uh, basically every time I leave my computer for more than a few minutes, more than a half hour, an hour, I am rendering something. And when I don't have something to render, I record another episode. So each day I can re render two or three episodes, basically. One when I go off to work, one when I go to sleep, and one usually in between when I have family time or whatever I, I do. The hard part is going to actually be getting to the nether fortress. I don't know how big a drop it is from the ceiling down to the blaze bonner that I want to control. And I don't want to control it today because I don't want to uh, deal with a blaze bonner or and stop a blaze bonner without uh, fire protection. Because if you have uh, the potion of fire protection and you're dealing with a blaze bonner, the blaze won't hurt you. Uh, the only time they actually hurt you is when they touch you and you get um, combat up close. Because if they, when they throw the, the fire at you, it doesn't even affect you at all. So when you have the fire potion on, it's just like you're walking around some cactus and the cactus move a little bit. <laughs> It'll hit you once. Which is a lot better than other things. So I guess um, when I'm done going to the blaze spawner, this mega tunnel of nasty red color, um, I will make the side chambers, which will only be like 20 blocks long off of this, to get to the other places. But I at least want to get this tunnel in 
so I can make the farm out of the blaze spawner probably next episode. It's looking like this is going to take forever and a day. I was going to say, where where is that uh, fortress again? But I see his fortress there. And I think if I were to be able to look backwards, the spawner was right there. So this would be a good place to go down. And do I have any normal blocks? I do. Well, you know, I'm going to die. <laughs> Okay, let's get over here and let's hope we can make that this jump. No, not again. Fuck. Sometimes you keep your mouth closed for reasons. And right now I have good reasons to keep my mouth closed. So yeah, I am actually, there is a person I've befriended a little bit. Um, her name is Mary. She's Lapis Demon. She just did the Hermitcraft UHC with X. And um, she has an ability that um, I also have, which connected us. Um, and I don't know if I've ever said this word right, synesthesia. Which means when you hear music, when you listen to music, you can visualize certain things. She visualizes colors. Um, I can actually see the music and... I've made videos or tried to make videos of what I see when I listen to specific songs. And um, I think she's German. I'm not too sure. I don't really... I haven't really hung out and talked with her, but we message each other back and forth about different music that is good to listen to uh, for what we do. And she makes her own music, and I, you know... Um, do also so we are combined in that way and uh, she just died she was the uh, second to last member <laughs> in the last Hermitcraft UHC and she died to cube hamster she's not a PvP player she seems a little anxious and nervous about things but um, the reason that I started talking to her was when she, I saw a post that she had the synesthesia and she posted some of her music and it was really good. Um, and what she does with her videos is she takes one of her songs and she specifically makes vi uh, music that you can loop. Um, basically, you, I don't know if she actually loops it mid song. You, you can take a program like Audacity, bring the WAV file in, and you can hit it right at the beginning of a beat and kind of hit the shift key and hit play and it will keep on looping and it won't feel like it's cut at all. It's kind of like making a GIF or something. you got to do it just right. Um, and it takes some practice to learn where you can cut music and do it. Um, and obviously I've done a lot of work like that, being a musician and uh, recording. And so I'm thinking part of creating music to put behind these episodes. A lot of the um, people who make YouTube videos with Minecraft put music very quietly in the background. So when there's nothing going on like this, there's music playing. So you don't hear my footsteps, you hear a beat in the background going or whatever, just to keep things interesting. And um, I'm thinking 
when I record this specifically I hope my shit's down here still and I hope I don't die okay let me concentrate a little bit get this down here my shit is still there I just want to get over to this so hopefully when I fall off, I fall to a place, I'm even going to go over a little bit more. Okay, here we go. Dromino, hope I don't die. Phew. Mushroom Island. Look at it. That's new terrain generation. It's taking so damn long. Mushroom Ireland. Oh yeah, baby. That is right. And look at that. Is this my Mega Taiga? If this is the actual Mega Taiga, I'm not gonna make another portal to to it. 